Hey everyone, it's Don with Don's Field of Dreams Cards. I have a video today to show you some recent pickups, a couple eBay pickups, uh, the three cards that I bought at the Strongsville, Ohio show this past weekend, and then I have a gift here from a fellow YouTuber that I'm going to open up. Uh, so let's start with the two eBay pickups. Picked up this really nice 1978 Thurman Munson. Um, I had this card as a kid, and I'm sure I have some of these raw, but, you know, as I've stated in other videos, cards from my youth are, are trashed. So, I uh, was looking at this in an eight, and then for half a grade, I could say $40, and I was like, come on, get the seven and a half. It's, it's a beautiful card, and I've always loved this pose of Thurman Munson. Um, so, happy to add that to the collection. Then recently, I've been adding some guys who are pretty much locks to make the Hall of Fame. And I have been picking up their rookie cards, even though I'm not a huge rookie card collector. I already had Ichiro. I picked up uh, Miggy Cabrera and Pujols, but I don't have the cards here in front of me. But I picked this one up, uh, the 1999 Topps traded CC Sabathia. And uh, for some reason, my, I seem to pick up a lot of Cleveland Indian cards. And you're going to see another one here soon so that usually makes my my buddy scott reindeer studio happy and uh got that in a nine got this for less than thirty dollars so just trying to be a little bit proactive and and pick some of these guys up so as i stated in my last video i, I went to the card show this weekend and drove up with dean gearhart i collected all in uh scott reindeer studios and as i said in that video I had a really good time with those guys and it, it made the made the show really enjoyable and then I saw on some uh, some other videos that Josh J. Stottlemyre one was there and Andrew Nuff said cards. So uh, really wish I had run into them, although Josh wasn't there on Sunday. But apparently uh, Andrew was, according to his video, but I, I just didn't see him. So, oh, well, it, it would have been nice seeing them, but uh, maybe at the National. So I only picked up uh, three cards at the show, but all... All Hall of Famers, and they're all from the 1950 Bowman set. So I'm trying to collect the Hall of Fame run. Picked up a nice George Kell. Make Scott and Nina S. happy again. Another Cleveland Indian. It's Larry Doby. So these will get sent off to SGC eventually. Um, I think with the three I picked up, I only need seven more Hall of Famers. And this was my big card that I picked up. Uh, needed to Ted Williams had this card before and I had mentioned in old videos that I had sold uh, had to sell some cards at one point and uh, honestly don't remember I said I had this card it might have been the 51 that I had before but uh, three and a half really nice centering no creases back look really good this guy had he had four of these and I was also looking at SGC2 which that was the one I was actually about to pull the trigger on now, when I flipped it in the light, saw a light crease coming down here. And uh, so this one cost me a little bit more than that one would have. But uh, really glad that I saw the crease on that other one and ended up with this one. So next, I got a package here. And uh haven't opened it yet, but I emailed the gentleman to see if it was okay to open it on the videos. And that's from our friend Bowman53. So what I believe this is, is my cash payment for mentioning him in uh, my last video. Jake, my uh, legends never die. I'm still waiting on your cash. So uh, speed it up, buddy. Alex is way ahead of you. So in all seriousness, I, I have no idea what this is. Uh, Alex texted me a couple weeks ago asking for my address and said to be on the lookout for this. So unlike Alex, who can wait three weeks to a month to open a package, I literally picked this up half an hour ago and I could barely wait this long to open it. But I texted him uh, if it was okay to open it on a video, and he said, go for it. And this is kind of going back to what I said in my last video is you, you get what you put into this community. And I'm not saying that I'm expecting gifts, and I don't think anyone here is. But a lot of us send them, and then we receive some. And um, there's no reason that this was sent other than kindness. And, uh, you know, I know he knows what I I like to collect, so... Maybe it's something along those lines, and, and maybe it's nothing at all. But let's uh, let's give this an open. It was already open a little bit. 
I'm always nervous cutting packages that, like this because I don't, I don't mess anything up. So, let's see here. It looks like a card. And, you know, I really should open this up before I started this because now I'm knocking over cameras. Another card. And, wow. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. And another part of the package. So let's start with the card. Since it looks like it's going to be the only easy thing to open here. Oh, what a cool card. Jackie Robinson. The Brooklyn Dodgers. Don, just a couple pieces for your wonderful collection. You already have one of these, but I'm not... Oh, but I'm sure you won't mind having it in a slightly larger size. Thanks for your friendship. Always enjoy. Take care. Best, Alex Bowman, 53. Sorry, I don't have my readers on, so that was a little bit of a struggle. So let's see what the card here is. Or cards. I can't tell what it is here. Oh, dude, thank you so much. I needed this one for my 53 set. Robin Roberts. So another set I'm collecting, at least up until maybe the mantle. I don't know if I'll get that, but pretty cool to have a 53 Bowman from Mr. 53 Bowman himself. So thank you, Alex. I really appreciate that. Let's see what this other package here is. It's like Christmas here, Alex. I appreciate it. Oh, oh no. Wait till you guys see this. Oh my god. I'm sorry I'm I don't have it on the camera right now, but I gotta get it out of the bubble wrap. Dude, this is so awesome. I don't know if I've ever told you guys, like I said about a hundred times. Look at this. 1954 Red Heart Stan Musial. Ox man, you didn't have to do this. I love it. Oh, this is so cool. It looks like he sent me, I guess this is the guy that, uh, he sent me some literature here. So if other people are interested, it looks like it's bopswallshop at gmail.com. And there's the guy's address. So I guess you can just tell him whatever card you want. And, uh, oh man, there's a whole catalog of them here. So, Alex, dude, you went way above and beyond. I am, it's going to be a main centerpiece of my collection. Uh, and I don't know what to say. Like, the Bowman card's awesome, but this is, this is more personal. And, and, uh, you, you went and got this for me, so... Um, like I said, there, there, there's so many good guys and girls in this community. And, uh, when you get a piece, no matter what it is from a fellow YouTuber, uh, I'll always remember where I got this Robin Roberts from and, and where I got this Stan Musial piece. And, and that's, it's one of the beauties of, of collecting. Um, if I bought this on eBay, it'd been cool, but it would have no meaning to me. It would have been just from a, a random person, um, that I bought a Robin Roberts and then to to give me something that I, that, you know, that I, that you know that I love. And I'm a big Stan Musial collector. I don't know. I'm going to have to take Dave Parker's spot in my videos for a while. But once again, thanks, Alex. Much appreciated. Uh, good friend. Hopefully I get to meet you uh, this summer at the National. Let's see if we can focus in on that bad boy a little bit more. And as always, guys. Thanks for watching my videos, and I'll talk to you soon.